Hey guys. Well, I woke up like this. I called myself pinning my hair up last night because I got my hair done yesterday. And I had on my bonnet. <clears throat> and this is how I woke up. I woke up like this. I'm just in my kitchen right now. I'm waiting for my pizza to heat up in the oven because I hate heating up pizza in the microwave. I got to be real hungry to eat heat up pizza in the microwave. We had pizza yesterday and um, buffalo wings. Ooh, I got to reheat my buffalo wings as well. I can put my buffalo wings in the microwave. I don't mind, but <clears throat> they should be getting done soon. But while I'm waiting for my pizza to heat up, matter of fact, let me check on my pizza. Let's check on the pizza, y'all. No. Mm -mm. Still gotta get cheesy. Okay, let me get back on the stool. That would have been an epic fail if I would have fell off the stool. Okay. So, um, yeah, as I was saying, I got my hair done yesterday. So curly and pretty, flowing. And I was gonna do a video yesterday while my hair was all flowy, but I was so tired. I was like, I'm not gonna do it. But I wanna partake in um vlogmas. Never did Vlogmas, never did October um, Vlog, whatever it's called. I never did any of those. I'm not really, like, consistent with vlogging. It's time-consuming to me, and I'll forget. But I'm already starting off at a bad start because it's December 3rd. And I think you're supposed to start the 1st of December because it's vlogging every day of December. Until Christmas, I believe. That's what it's about. I've been watching people, um, vlogs for Vlogmas, but I really want to partake in it, and I think it will be fun. So, starting off today, this will be my first vlog, um, which is December 3rd. Um, I'm off today. Y'all gotta catch me when I'm off. My little mini mouse nightgown from Walmart. But yeah, y'all have to catch me when I'm off, or I have to be in, like, um, I have to be in the mood to record, really, being honest. Like, if I'm tired from work, y'all don't want to see me like that. Or if I'm going to work, it's going to be short. I mean, I can vlog day by day. Like, I can extend this one if I wanted to. But me, myself, I'll forget. I'm good at hauls and everything like that. I got a, I got a huge haul for y'all coming up. I have a huge, huge haul, which I'm going to try my best to record today and um, upload today. Y'all going to love it. Y'all going to love it. But right now, I'm in a good mood. But I really want to get this Forever 21 rant in. <sighs> it smells like it's burning, but it's nowhere near done. I think I have it too high. I'm going to turn it down. I think it's too high. I'm sorry. I'm going from one extreme to the next. All right, it was on 350. I'm going to turn it to 200. Because pizza do not need to be that hot. That's just being reheated anyways. Let me see. Uh, see, the thing is, this oven gets so damn hot. Ooh. Right now, parts of it is... Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I should cut it off and start over. Oh, look at this. I don't know if y'all can see. Sorry if I'm steaming up the camera, but you know what happened? I think the cheese got too close to the pan, which is making it seem like it's burning, but it's actually not. I just don't like that smell. And the oven is like really smoky. I think that I turned it down. It's better. All up in your face. What is that? What is that? What is that? We have no doubt. I hear a cat crying, but it's not my cat. I just fed the cats. Um, okay. Yeah. Back to what I was saying. Let me get back on this stool. Alright. Y'all see my cat food up there, but uh... Yeah, so, um, day before Thanksgiving, Wednesday, um, this is my Forever 21 rant. Now, y'all know, y'all know how much I love and live for Forever 21, how much I 
shop there, how much I should be a model for them because I shop there so much. Y'all see my Forever 21 clothes. Whenever I'm doing a video, I usually 9 out of 10 have on Forever 21 clothing. If not everything from Forever 21. Y'all know how much I love them. And I just live by their clothing. And I'm always shopping there. So, Wednesday, who was it? Wednesday night, the day before Thanksgiving, I'm going to say like 2 to 3 o'clock in the morning. I believe it was 3 o'clock in the morning. I'm on their site seeing all these good items that I want, just putting everything in my cart, seeing good deals. They had a 30% off sale. Um, was it all clearance? I think everything was 30, additional 30% off, or certain items was additional 30% off, but everything I had was additional 30% taken off. So I'm shopping, just putting everything. By the time I'm finished, it hits like around, I'm going to say 3.30 to 4 o'clock in the morning. I didn't go to bed till 6 o'clock in the morning, um, day before Thanksgiving. You might as well say Thanksgiving Day because I didn't go to bed till 6 o'clock in the morning. And I remember because me and my mom was up cooking and everything, laughing and everything. So, um, first of all, I had a problem. Oh, excuse me, my nose is in allergies. I had a problem submitting my order. So, I didn't want to be charged twice. So I'm like, should I resubmit it or just wait a little while? So I waited a little while. Um, I guess everybody was ordering at the same time because the deals were so good. So I waited and I'm checking out through PayPal, mind you. Um, so in order for me to check out, I have to sign into my PayPal account and go through all that. Not that it's a lot, but um, it was just a screen kept on saying it's going to take at least three minutes. Three minutes turned into 10 minutes. 10 minutes turned into 20 minutes. 20 minutes turned into like a half an hour. Then I was like, I'm just going to wait. I just exited out of that. Wait a whole hour. See if I was charged. I was not charged. And then I um, um went back to see if my stuff was still in the cart. Everything was still in the cart. So I processed my order again. Um, Everything went through fine. And then you know how it asks you to continue shopping. So I went to continue shopping. This had to be like around 4 o'clock in the morning. Don't you know? I went into um, on their website, continue shopping, looking at stuff. Thinking I might have missed something that I might want something else. Like let me order something else. And now that I like the fact that, um, and they had free shipping too. They had free shipping as well. And you know, they never really had free shipping. And, um, they never had ship to store. So they just recently added ship to store on their website, which I'm like, oh yes, Forever 21, you read my mind. I always want to that they had Forever, um, ship to store. Cause y'all know I do not like to pay for shipping. I would rather put, add up my item, something that was like $20, add it up to $50 so I can get free shipping. Cause anything $50 or over, you get free shipping. So I rather add more items to my cart to get their free shipping because I do not pay for shipping. I hate paying for shipping and I never pay for shipping. If I have to pay for shipping, it's because I really, really, really want that item at the right at that time and I didn't um either have the money to um put more to um get free shipping or I just didn't want to. Um or I really didn't need any more items. But anyway, I'm getting off subject. So it's not like that piece is burning, but it's not. I know it's not. Um yeah, so I continue shopping. Let me take a breath. Mind you, I've been getting emails since two weeks ago or two weeks before Thanksgiving that they're having a 30%. Like, you better start shopping now on 30% off and all that. Like, they're getting you. Like, you're, you're just getting it. So I'm like, okay, I am gonna. I was going to plan on shopping here anyway. But the 30% really put the icing on the cake. So, I continue shopping. Do you know all the items that I just bought and more? Same items. Additional 50% taken off. And it's only been like a half an hour within I was buying my stuff. Y'all know I was hot. Heated. Hot, 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 And you know, sometimes on PayPal, you can like cancel your order or do something like that. I never knew how to, but it's a link that you can do or something you click on to cancel it. Don't hold me on that, but I know it's something like that that you can. I was trying to do that so bad. I contacted Forever 21. Of course, everything is closed. You got to wait till Monday. I, um, 
whoop his ass. Because one of my cats is eating another one's food. And I just told his ass not to do that. He's going to get a beating. Um, he's not, but... Um, yeah, so... I'm emailing them. I'm like, um... Yeah, I just placed the order. It's only like 10 minutes to 15 minutes. Half an hour at the most apart. Um... And y'all just changed the cell that fast and I just placed my order. Like, please give me an adjustment. Um, even if you can give me a gift card or just cancel the order, I'll reorder the items. All this stuff. So, and this was on, like, we're now into Thanksgiving Day because I didn't go to bed until 6 o'clock in the morning. So, I'm mad. I'm pissed off. It was, I'm going to say, I lost out on $40, 40 to $50 that I could have saved. And with that money, I know for a fact that it wouldn't have been in my pocket. I would have got more stuff from Forever 21. I would have bought more stuff with the money. I wouldn't even have the money to myself. I would have bought more stuff with. I'm glad I'm doing this right now because if I would have did it then, I would have been cussing, screaming, and everything. I was pissed, mad. I'm still a mad because I shopped here so much, and I put that in the email, like, and they took so long to get back to me. Once they got back to me, talking about something, oh yeah, we don't do um, price adjustments with our policy. We don't do price adjustments. We don't. Um, we can't do anything like that once your order is through. That's that, and all this, and then very, first of all, their policy sucks. Their return policy and everything like that. For them to be such a big company, you would think that you can get your money back, but you can't. But I never had a problem with that because everything that I usually buy usually fits. And I always like the stuff. I never really had to return. If I had to return, it was like a defect, something on their part. But I never really returned anything to Forever 21. Or if I did, it probably didn't fit right. I didn't like it or something like that. But I never had a problem with them. But everybody that I refer to Forever 21, they'd be like, Girl, why you didn't tell me that that policy that you can't return or anything? But I'm so used to them that I know I... I know my size there and everything, and everything looks nice. So, I never had a problem with the return policy, but it really does suck. Like, you should give people their money back, or at least put it back on their card. You can only get a gift card, and then the sell items, your shit out of luck. You're just going to have to keep them jewelry. You can't return anything like that. So, um, and I actually thought everything I bought was sell items, but none of any of the things that I bought was not sell items. So I can return that stuff if I wanted to. I thought I couldn't because I thought they were sell items. I told my friend because she was like, just return it or something like that. And I was like, they're all sell, final sell. But they weren't because I just received the package. Actually, I'm going to do a haul on the, these items. But um, I just received the package and they're not sell items. I wasn't going to open it, but I wanted to open it because that was the stuff that I was planning on returning. I wanted to see the receipt. So I'm sorry I opened that. But everything else is going to be an unboxing as well. So get ready for that haul. Hopefully today, later on today. Just give me a chance to eat my pizza and my wings. And I'll be all happy and excited to do the haul. But right now, I'm not. But try to make a long story short. Um, They said, and thank you for understanding. So I emailed them. I understand. I emailed them back and was like, no, I do not understand. No, thank you for understanding because I don't understand shit. I didn't say shit, but I don't understand anything. I was like, I don't understand. I shot with y'all too frequently and I'm really like part of y'all family, basically. Like, y'all need to just let me be a part of the team because I'm always shopping for, from Forever 21. Always advertising their clothes. Everywhere I go, like my bathing suits and everything, I always let them know where I got it from Forever 21. I'm always getting compliments. And <clears throat> They don't pay me for this. Like, I um, advertise them on my YouTube channel. I got a lip gloss on my hand. I advertise them on my um, YouTube channel and everything. And it's not because I'm getting paid for it because I'm not. They don't pay me a dime. I just love their clothing. And when I love something, I go hard for it. And when I love someone, I go hard for them. Like, I'm always supporting. So, I was just, I was, I was just, my feelings was hurt more than anything because I just knew that they were going to, because they always like sending me stuff like, thank you for being a VIP, coupons and everything like that, once in the blue, but they send it, I get it, I get them, like the VIP stuff, so I'm like, y'all know I'm VIP, like y'all not going to help me out at all, like I was so mad, so when I sent that email that I don't understand, excuse my nose, I don't understand and everything like that, 
I didn't get a response until yesterday. And this was like, Thanksgiving was last week, right? I didn't get a response until yesterday. This is a whole week later. And they did say sorry for taking so long. But I'm going to have to cut the video. Ooh. I'm going to have to stop and then come back, y'all. Hey, y'all. I'm back. I'm sorry. I had to cut off the mic with the door. And my food is done. Took my pizza. It's not burnt, but it's like... Well done. And extra crispy. But it's not burnt. But, um... We have a time. Well, yeah, my phones will take more than anything. And... Wait. What was I saying? Um... I can't remember. I was trying to make a long story short. That, um, basically, I was ripped off. Oh, that my stuff is not so item, so I can return to my room. Um, sorry. I'm just pissed off with them. I feel some type of way. I really, really, really do. I was really hurt. And as much as I wanted to order something when it was 50% off, I said, hell no, I'm not. I said, then tomorrow they probably have a better deal, 60% off. I did want some stuff. I didn't order it because I caught myself being mad with them and everything like that. Next day, they put it back on to 30% off. Didn't have a big sale. So if y'all a bigger deal... If y'all ever want to get a deal from them, and y'all call yourself like shopping for Cyber Monday or Black Friday or whatever, Black Friday don't have the good deals. It's Wednesday night. Or well, might as well say Thanksgiving Day, Thanksgiving morning. That's when the good deals is. That's when the 50% off will have or you want to say. Black Friday only had 30% off, which was nothing compared to 50% off. So if y'all ever want to know a good deal or get a good deal, I don't know if it works like that with all um, stores, but Forever 21, that's how it works. They try to get you. So, I didn't get anything done. Everything went to back to 30% off. That Saturday or Sunday, I saw something that I liked. Of course, me. I'm a shopaholic. I ended up buying something. It was on sale. It wasn't 30% off or anything like that. It was just one sale, and I liked it, so I just got it. It was just one item, and it was free shipping. I'm mad with them. I'm not going to say, oh, they would never get my money again. I'm not shopping with them, because I'll be lying. God, no, I'm still going to shop with them. Yes, it's just their policy. I took it as a loss. You live and you learn. I know better next time. When you know better, you do what? You do better. So I won't ever do that again, and... I try my best not to because I, I know when their deals are done. But my thing is I can't wait. When I like something, I just get it. I'm not the type that like wait for sales or wait for something to go on sale. Like I love a good sale and this icing on the cake when it's a good sale. But if I like something and I have the money for it, I'm going to get it. I can't wait. I have to get it. Because then what if it's not there? Then I'm like, what if they don't have my size when I go back? Or what if it's sold out? I'm going to be mad at myself because I didn't get it, huh? Took it as a law. And I'm still doing this rap. Y'all share this video. Y'all tag them, please. So they can know how mad I am. But they know in their email. I'm not hurting. I don't even know that thing. But that's it. I just want to come, come on here and tell y'all I'm going to vlog me. And give y'all my little favorite 21 rant. And I got a big call, a huge call for y'all, so get ready for that. But yeah, I'm going to end this vlog. I'm going to eat my food. Get some napkins. So I don't have no napkins. Um, actually, I did have napkins. They all fell on the floor, and I threw them out. I could have used them for something else, but I got mad and threw them out. Looking around for napkins. Looking around for something that's not there, but anyway. I'll be back later on, guys. 
Thanks again for all the support, sharing, liking, subscribing, of course. Thank y'all so much. And see y'all later on. So I'll be looking out for my video later on. Bye.